The Western Conference Finals, Game 4. The Los Angeles Lakers have simply been on a rampage, storming through the finals, and with a commanding 3-0 lead, they now have a chance to do what very few teams have even dreamed of. Can they sweep their way to the Larry O'Brien Trophy in a Game 4 against the Dallas Mavericks? Will round three end in an upset of epic proportions coming right up? Thank you for joining us here on 2K Sports. One team with its back against the wall. The other with a chance for a spot in the finals. Can it go to a game five? We'll have to see. This is Kevin Harlan and joining me tonight, Chris Weber and Greg Anthony. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. The two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Paul out there with Patrick Beverly and it's healed in at the three slot. And for the Mavericks, the guard pair, it's Doncic and Hardaway. Moses Brown is out there with Porzingis, and it's Murray in at the three, the small forward. We take a look at the Mavericks. Greg, they're on the ropes, but I think they're playing for pride tonight. What about you? Yeah, I mean, where's your head at? Are you ready to start that summer vacation, or are you determined not to go quiet? So the Lakers win the tip. Now James. And it's out of bounds. Well, they say it was last touch by Brown. Here's Paul. to the paint down to five on the shot clock and Davis throws it down cutting the D to shreds in the pick and roll that's Chris Paul with a beautiful dish on the wing Hardaway defended by Beverly Porzingis sets the pick for Hardaway he takes it in as out of bounds the Mavericks able to retain possession here an outstanding defensive play to earn the mobile one block and that block was something. It's the playoffs, and every possession and defensive stop matters. Just five to shoot. Brown dishes to Murray. Here's Doncic, and count it from 19 feet away. And scanning the floor well. Porzingis all about finding open teammates when they've got a look. LeBron with a screen on Doncic. Paul passes the Whoa! Whoa! What a Whoa! finish! Run that back. I, I want to see the replay now. <laughs> oh. I love how fierce James is. A ferocious dunk artist. And that's life above the rim. Courtesy of our AT&T 5G Slam King. Down low, here's Persingas. LeBron with the block. And he's able to get it back. Last break, the Lakers. Davis has got the ball. Took him no time at all on that one. Well, on offense, Davis keeps his head up and maintains awareness. That's how he spots a wide open man. And the pass to Persingas on the wing hard away. To the inside. Porzingis sets the pick for Hardaway. Into the lane. Brown wide open. He fires. And a miss there on the triple. Oh man, as good of a shooter as he is, it drives him crazy to miss a wide open three like that. Here's Paul. To Davis and it's Davis with the jam. Nice play, and, and you can see they're gathering momentum. They've been a more cohesive team over this stretch, and that helps account for their lead. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. Brown to end the run, and he uses the glass on the way home. And no basket feels better than a putback. Love getting rewarded for grinding it out on the glass. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Kevin, Casey Kidd and I talked a few minutes ago. 
He told me that despite everything, he still believes in his team's ability to take at least one game in the series. But of course, that has to be tonight. He looks at this as a building block saying, what they learn in this series, win or lose, should be invaluable for the future. Kevin? Thanks, David. Singus passes to Doncic. Over Paul. Odds are hard away. Porzingis with a screen on James. Back to Brown. Dallas needs to get off a shot. Hardaway for three. And they recover it. Nothing that time. He's uh, 0 for 2. Mulligan to Doncic. Davis with a screen on Doncic. And it's Davis missing. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Paul against Doncic. Here's Brown. That doesn't go either for Brown. And this quarter, he has clearly been off the mark. LeBron is screen on Brown. Over in the corner, Beverly. Heeled outside. Davis with a screen on Brown. And Davis throws it down. Oh, I can't think of a better partner to have in the pick and roll than Davis. Sets hard screens and has the soft hands to match. Inside, here's Hardaway. Anthony Davis grabs the miss. Davis has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Mulligan, Hardaway. Paul kicks to Davis. It's stolen by Brown. Over in the corner, Doncic. Back to Hardaway. Fires the three. It's hauled in by Beverly. It's been a really tough quarter for him. I mean, he cannot get his shots to drop. Over in the corner, Paul. LeBron sets the screen for Paul. Porzingis with the block. And the 7-3 reach of Porzingis being put to great use there. Paul against Doncic. Outside, Porzingis. In the corner, Hardaway with it. Overhealed, and Davis sends it back. Well, you see how the Browns led the league in swats. <laughs> Not only the wingspan, but the awareness. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Lakers. They deserve a lot of credit for the defense they've played in the paint here early. Contesting shots, blocking shots, just making life difficult on the opposing shooters in general. And also, how about the fact defensively they're getting that backboard and getting out in transition, especially in this first half. Anthony Melton, he's jacked in for Hardaway. Let's take his chance now to show you the list of the postseason scoring leaders. Number one, Luka Doncic. Some nice passing here by Dallas. Melton finds Doncic. Back to Melton. Murray is screen on Beverly. 
Melton feeling it out a bit. Connects from three-point range. Wow, he's a confident shooter from three-point range. I mean, even with the D hovering near him. All against Dungeon. Davis. And it's Davis finishing it off. Assistant. Pass first attitude. Paul, I mean, so adept at finding his teammates in their spots, especially in the middle. Melton passes to Doncic. Brzingis trying to get free. And Doncic gets it to go. Doncic has got his second best. Hit works well there. Not much resistance from the D. But it's a lazy effort. Let's just be honest. Hoping the shooter misses. That doesn't constitute defense. Murray against Teal. Pass to Melton. Here's Doncic. Over Paul. And it's off the back rim. No good. Los Angeles leading by seven. Davis with a screen on Doncic. A drive by Paul. Here's Davis. Paul outside. Davis sets a screen. Paul passes to Davis. And finished off by Davis. And the brow gets up. Get out of the way. Unless you want to be on the post. And here's Melton. He'll bring it up for the Mavericks. This is to Brown. Doncic with a screen on Beverly. And Davis sends it back. And so the ball out of bounds. Davis touched it last. A different look for Dallas. At least checked in for Moses Brown. Cody Zeller comes in for Perzingis. And it's Juan Hernan Gomez in for Murray. And Zeller kicks to Hernan Gomez. Lock at six. It's stolen by Davis. And here is Paul. To the middle. And Davis throws it down hard. Oh, uh, and for a big man, Davis has some sweet dunks. He's awesome. Mavericks trail by 11. Pass to Zeller. Anjic outside. Bradley is screen on Paul. The three for Doncic. Sinks the triple. Doncic has got seven. Shots are just flowing. Him right now having a really strong boy. Paul passes to James. It's tipped. And registering one of the highest verticals at the NBA Combine. Zeller can send your shot back. And finish off by Davis. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. They decided to pound the ball inside, using their physicality to set the tone. They set the pick. Doncic against Paul. Doncic, no good. Lakers leading by 10. Davis sets a screen. Paul with the ball. He's picked up by Doncic. Yeah, the coaching staff values the effect that Davis has on the team. I mean, he's a strong enough player that the rest of the guys can really rally around. First trip to the line for him here. A free throw, no good. Wow, but he has something in his eye on that shot. <laughs>
and he's good on the second. Average trail by 11. And Doncic, here we go. A fearless competitor when Doncic is driving inside. He just embraces the contact on the way up. The first one falls. At the line for two. Free throw is good from Doncic. Lakers leading by nine. Healed the pass to Paul. To the inside, Davis. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. It's on Luka Doncic. Over the course of AD's career, he's made a concerted effort to draw fouls. I mean, we've seen that he go attempt on the sky. This is his second trip to the free throw line. And the first one at the line is good. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. Average trailed by 11. Now, here's Melton. Doncic with it, and they're trying to break free. And that one's good, Doncic. Doncic has got 11 points. He's wrapped up his game in a big way this quarter. I don't think he likes it when they're trailing. Paul looking around. LeBron sets the screen for Paul. Six to shoot. And LeBron. finished off by LeBron. When you find yourself up double digits in the first quarter, you know you're doing something right. Yeah, true. But now it's about sustaining their energy and maintaining the focus. Paul with the steal. Davis setting the pick for Paul. Down low, and it's Davis finishing it off. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. Going for the juggler right off the bat. I mean, jumping out to an impressive early lead. 133 left to play here in the first. Bradley is green on Beverly. Bradley kicks to Doncic. And the call on the shot sends him to the line. That's his second personal foul. What determination from Doncic pushing his shot through despite some stiff defense to draw the foul. Some changes for the Lakers. DeMarcus Cousins comes in for Anthony Davis. And Chris Dunn subbed in for Chris Paul. We've got 118 left in the first. Down against Doncic. Now done. To the paint. Here's LeBron. Oh, and he misses the dunk. Here's Melton. Doncic outside. Let's the free fly. And they get it back. Zeller, a screen on Beverly. Here's Melton. Here's Bradley. Yet again, passes to Melton. Six on the shot clock. It's tipped. Oh, and Beverly just goes all out on defense. This is what allows him to come up with these rejections. They've been beating them to a lot of those loose balls and rebounds here to start. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. LeBron passes to heel. Back to James. From deep. That shot, no good. And so it's Los Angeles going into the break with a 10-point lead. And they've done a phenomenal job down low. So many of their points coming right at the rim. Back right after this. Ladies 
and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. And we welcome you back to Game 4 on 2K Sports. And taking a look at Los Angeles' performance here, what have they been doing or not doing? Just a terrific first quarter, sparked really by their unselfishness. Oh, yeah. Love the ball movement so far. Everything clicking at the offensive end. And a moment now to reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up for the second quarter of basketball. So for the Lakers right now, they've got DeMarcus Cousins. Buddy Heald is out there with LeBron James. Then there's Dunn, and it's Richardson in at the two guard. Dunn kicks to Cousins. There's the triple. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. They come off the loss on Friday. I'll tell you, they played hard. They drew fouls. But they could not convert at the line. You can't leave empty points at the line. Those are gimmies. No excuses. Comes up empty down low. The Mavericks trail by 10. Brzingis with the ball. He's picked up by Cousins. And there's the pass to Persingas. And a miss there with a chance to cut the lead to single digits. And here's Don. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Phil is an excellent shooter. He's fantastic at going into contact. He likes getting to the line. Los Angeles shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. And the first one drops. DeAndre Jordan's checked in for DeMarcus Cousins. Both free throws good from heel. And what an advantage. You really feel like you can always trust him when he's at the line. Hardaway passes to Doncic. Good for another field goal. Number five on the night. Five for ten shooting. And it doesn't matter if Luka is working on or off the ball. You have to stay connected to him defensively. And a deep three from James. Los Angeles with another miss. Mavericks trail by ten. Doncic kicks to Hardaway. Back to Doncic. For the three. Drills it from outside. Doncic has got 17 now. And when he's knocking down the triple, pack it up. There's nothing you can take away from Luka. Here's James. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance That's at the line. Second, foul. second team foul. Lakers shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. LeBron James. At the line for two. First one falls for him. No wasted trips at all. They're taking care of business at the line. And both free throws good for LeBron. And it took them a while to find their touch at the line, but they have been red hot here in the second quarter. Doncic outside from downtown. That drops and it comes off the assist from Hardaway. Doncic has got 20. And they are absolutely stroking it from beyond the arc. James looking around. Inside, short. Murray with the defensive effort. Mavericks trail by six. Step back shot. Out to Hardaway. Another shot. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot too. Yeah, just not being as physical inside as they need to be right now. They're not creating the second chance opportunities that they did in the first. For Dallas, they have gone three or four at the free throw line tonight. Browns checked in for the Mavericks. And Los Angeles making a change here as well. But Toombs checked in. Hardaway hits them both. Lakers leading by four. Here in the second quarter, we've played a little over two and a half minutes now. And it's done penetrating. And while we have a chance, let's go and take a look at the NBA's season assist leaders. Third is Luka Doncic. And it seems like he's taking it on his shoulders to get every one of his teammates involved in the offense here in the postseason. What a passing display. There's no question Dunn is a great athlete, but he must first work on his shooting as well as his passing. Dwight Howard has checked in for the Lakers. 
Murray dishes to Doncic. Back to Murray. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. It's on Dwight Howard. Really, uh, the right play defensively, if you can't block, force him to the line. The Mavericks have shot a good percentage from the free throw line so far. They've made five out of six. And he sinks the second. Lakers leading by four. Done outside. And the foul called on Porzingis. That is his first foul of the game. And the Lakers making a change here. Davis has checked in. Lakers substitution. Anthony Davis. Order number two around three minutes gone by. To the middle. He kicks to Howard. Lakers passing it around. Heel can't hit. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. L.A. has gone 0-3 from beyond the arc to start the second quarter. Richards in the pass to Heel. Now here is Davis. Porzingis with the block. And he recovers it. And finish off by Anthony Davis. Well, if you're the D, you got to box out Davis. So that's just kind of system. You don't hurt you for this type of mistake. Hardaway against Richardson. Brown the pass to Hardaway. Back to Brown. And finished off by Brown. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. And rightfully so. Also, how lackluster was the defense right there with the score this tight? That's his second personal foul. He's gone. Three for four from the line. Shooting for Los Angeles. Anthony Davis. First free throw is good. Aldwell Pope, he's checked in for Los Angeles. And so Anthony Davis nails both of them. Average trail by six. And here is Doncic. He's got 20. Outside Hardaway. Good. And the assist goes to Doncic. And the all-around game of Doncic. Not just a scorer, but a great dime dropper as well. Notices his open teammates quickly. Done with it. Now guarded by Porzingis. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's his third personal foul. He's had six attempts at the line. Made five of them. At the line for the Anthony Davis. First free throw is good. He doesn't get the second one. The Mavericks have gotten just over 50% of their shots to drop here in the second quarter. They're five for nine. Here's Murray, and it's Murray with the jam. Oh, going high to throw that one down. Sky high, fantastic one-hand jam. To the inside. Here's Davis. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That's his second personal foul. People don't talk about it. He's an excellent foul shooter. About 80% more shots. This will make five trips now to the free throw line for him tonight. And both free throws good for Davis. Average trail by five. Hardaway is screen on down. Howard against Porzingis. On the wing, Brown. Shot clock at six. Hardaway for three. No good, shot missing. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Here's Davis. Back to Richardson. Dunn passes to Davis. And it's blocked by Brown. They retain possession. Davis setting the pick for Caldwell Pope. 
and taken away by Brown. And Dodgic, here we go. Upside Brown. And Davis sends it back. Richardson against Hardaway. Outside Davis. And they double up Davis. Richardson outside. Pass to Dunn. Down low. That's good from Davis on the assist from Dunn. Assisted. That's 28 points for Anthony Davis. His teammates keep getting him the ball in his favorite spots. He's done a lot for his shooters. Anthony Melton comes in for Doncic. Martin's checked in for the Lakers. Howard against Porzingis. Now here's Melton. Guarded close. Going inside. Does not score again. That's his fourth miss against one make. Outside, Martin. Davis with a screen on Hardaway. Martin, he feeds it to Davis. And it's blocked by Brown, and he gets it back. And it's Martin missing. Milton with the ball. Picked up by Davis. Pass to Hardaway. Trying to get something going. And the shot no good, a bit short. You know what, he's just stone cold right now. Really not sure if he's their best option offensively as they try to get back in this game. Caldwell Pro pass to Davis. Where he this with the block. Outside Hardaway. The screen from Brown. Melton the bounce pass. Hardaway against Caldwell Pope. Six to shoot. Hardaway, no good. Lakers leading by seven. Davis kicks to Martin. Davis setting the pick for Martin. And it's Davis with the jam. So tough to contain Davis when he's on a roll. He's got the physicality and an expansive on the last one. Hardaway against Martin. Porzingis with a screen on Martin. Here's Hardaway. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. And, and he has definitely been struggling in this quarter. Oh, just off this game, forcing a few shots, not letting the game come to him. Davis with it. Now guarded by Porzingis. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That's his third personal foul. Oh, the officials are all over that one. Quite a few trips to the line in this one, and he's making them count, going 8 for 10 at the line so far. And that one falls for Davis. And love how he's getting himself to the line this quarter. If he keeps it up, 
it'll end up creating some foul problems on the other side, and that can always help a team's call. Tony Bradley's checked in for Dallas. Cody Zeller comes in for Porzingis. And there have been some terrible shot choices here, Kev. That's not a good look at all. Here's Caldwell Pope. Davis inside, guarded by Bradley. They get it back. They shoot again, and it's Davis laying it in. Davis has got 33 points. And I love the tenacity, guys. He simply can will his way into games at times and exert his presence. Davis against Bradley. And Davis sends it back. And he recovers it. Well, this is one of the areas you can work when Zeller gets most of his offense. Either converting inside, going to the line, or both. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And he knocks down the first one. And Los Angeles with some changes. DeMarcus Cousins is checked in for Anthony Davis. Jordan comes in for Dwight Howard. And it's Patrick Beverly in for Mark. Richardson gets a wide open look. A three-pointer no good. And it's Bradley with the ball for Dallas. They trail by 11. Bradley is screen on Caldwell Pope. And finished off by Hernan Gomez. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Come on, guys. Someone has to rotate over. Defensively, that's just poor communication. Now here's Pepper. He's guarded by Melton. Here's Cousins. Good on the three-point shot. Uh, assists like that have typified their effort today. Terrific ball movement. Here's Melton, defended by Beverly. Hardaway passes to Hernan Gomez. To the paint, here's Bradley, and he takes the feed in stride and slams it home. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, G.A., right when your teammate makes that kind of play. They needed that, and I love that he just didn't settle for the lay-in. Sets and slips with the best. I mean, DJ Masters. That's the big fella getting all worked up. He loves those throwouts. Beverly against Brandon. And Cousins throws it down. Wonderful move by Pat Beverly. A true talent at executing the pick and roll perfect. Now, here's Melton. Passes it to Zeller. Right side Bradley. Dallas moving the ball around. Zeller, a screen on Beverly. And the rejection by Cousins. And one of the things Cousins has continued to develop is defense. Really makes an effort to swat that shot away. Lakers leading by 12. Beverly feeling it out a bit. Now the pass to Cousins. Fires for three. And another three for the Lakers. I mean, it took him a long time to get into the flow of the game, but the points are starting to come for him. Takes it inside. Melton kicks to Zeller. Melton passes to Hardaway. Bradley sets the pick for Hardaway. Feeds it to Bradley. And he goes strong at the one-handed jam. Oh, up high and down hard with that one-hander. He got a little extra forceful. You're right with that one. Outside for Caldwell Pope. This three-pointer is off the mark. And Benny Davis firing on all cylinders for the Los Angeles Lakers. He made his mark in a big way on the boards in that court. Got a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Chris, a very effective first half. What are you seeing that allows you to attack them so effectively? Well, one of these games is very up-tempo, fast-paced, and, you know, if they just run, I, I have fun, you know, assisting and passing them the ball, so it's a fun game for me. The game's easy when you play downhill. Thanks, Chris. Back to you, Kevin. All right, Dave, thank you, and time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports.
Hello and welcome. And here in game four, you couldn't have drawn up a better first half for the Los Angeles Lakers. The difference so far has been the efficiency of their offense. Their ball movement is really good. They're not afraid to use the whole shot clock if they have to. Overall, they're making every possession count. Looking at the series breakdown for the Mavericks. Hey, Big, how tough is it to get motivated for a game like this when your season is more or less over? Someone who's got a problem getting motivated for any playoff game should not be in the NBA. This is where you got to bring it, Ernie. Lay it all on the line, every time. You know what? No one wants to go out of the playoffs with the weapon. They want to go out fighting. That will, that energy, they won't roll over. That'll do it for us. With a whimper, we go back to court side. What an atmosphere in here as we return to the action of the Western Conference Finals. You look at Anthony Davis in this game, he's been everywhere. Well, with a double-double in hand through two quarters, you can just imagine what his stat line will look like at the end of this one. Yeah, it could be one of those epic games, but we still have a long way to go. Mavericks trailed by 13. For the guard pair, it's Doncic and Hardaway. Chris Stapps Porzingis is out there with Moses Brown. And it's Murray in at the three. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. And there's the call on Patrick Beverly. First team. That is his first foul of the game. And that was a great replay we just saw of our mobile one block. And well, they make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now their defense is in overdrive. Cousins against Brown. Back to Doncic. Six on the shot clock. And the rejection by Cousins. They grab their own miss. And he gets it back. Goes up again. Doncic, no good. He's not an easy man to stop when he's attacking the basket. The D doing everything he can. And that one is good. And what confidence from Beverly squaring himself up as the pass was coming his way. So he was ready to fire. Hardaway against Beverly. Doncic outside. Here's Brown. And James pulls it down. LeBron's got his fourth rebound in this one. Oh, no one around him. Drops in the tray off the fast break. What I like about Paul, he picks smart shots to take, especially when he's behind the arc. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, that, their offense has ground to a standstill. He's been cold, and it's been hurting them. D, I mean, he's ready for him. He hasn't been able to solve it. James, a screen on Doncic. Pass to Cousins. Heald kicks to Paul. Driving the lane. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Paul's got his third basket of the night right there. And their balanced effort at both ends has hushed this crowd. No, this is going dead silent in this arena. What a fantastic performance here on the road. Outside Hardaway to stop the run. And then Brown with the dunk. Nothing soft about the putback there. And why chance it, right? Take the dunk if you've got it. Yeah, guys, but where was the box out? No excuse letting him roll that freely on the glass. A drive by Paul. Here's Cousins. It's stolen by Brown. Hard away against Paul. Pass to Doncic. Murray outside. Doncic passes to Murray. Outside, Brzingis. Brown kicks to Murray. The three for Doncic. Rebound the Lakers. Cousins has got five rebounds tonight. A lot of damage from three-point range in the first half, but so far in the second, he hasn't done a thing. Paul with the ball, now guarded by Porzingis. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. It's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. Uh, that's just superb concentration despite getting hit. James is just excellent at scoring through contact. This is his third free-throw attempt of the game. Mavericks trail by 21. Hardaway with it. 
Donchich outside. This one for three. Yes, and it's Hardaway picking up the assist. Hardaway has got his seventh assist here tonight. There you go. That's the stroke that we saw in the first half. Cousins with a screen on Doncic. The drive by Paul. Beverly wide open. That one wide left. I guess even he has to miss one of those once in a while. Porzingis. The offensive rebound. And another shot. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. And he's able to get it back. Beverly against Hardaway. Shot clock at five. Brown sets a screen for Hardaway. Missed it. Even after all those chances. Ball against Doncic. Ball outside. Cousins with a screen on Doncic. Paul goes in. He trains it as the shot clock ticks down. Paul's got 10 points. I love how creative Paul is. Penetrating inside. Talented, reading angles, and exploiting holes. Doncic against Paul. Porzingis kicks to Hardaway. Over in the corner, Brown. And here's Doncic from the arc. Rebound by DeMarcus Cousins. Cousins has got rebound number seven for him tonight. Cousins with a screen on Doncic. Paul passes to Cousins. Doncic with a steal. In the corner, Murray with it. Up top, Doncic. James covered. And there's the call on Patrick Beverly. That'll be his second foul of the game. Howard's checked in for DeMarcus Cousins. White Hard away against Beverly. Looking to end his cold spell. And the rejection by James. Mavericks ball. And the Mavericks call time here. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. Four rotations. I mean, slow help and just not enough toughness on the interior. They've got a lot to talk about. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. Here are this postseason's dead eye shooter. These guys have knocked down a ton of shots from downtown. Luka Doncic fourth. He is having so much success from beyond the three point line. Some guys just thrive on this kind of pressure. Five to shoot and stolen by James. Three pointer. Rebounded by Hardaway. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. Hardaway sets a screen for Doncic. Outside Hardaway. Outside for Murray. Now Porzingis. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Here's Doncic. That's tipped. 
And it's sent back by Howard. You got to be aware of Howard at all times, especially on defense, where he makes his living and block his shots. And now we'll get perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for Los Angeles. All those block shots, that's a clear indicator of the great D they've been playing. Not giving them an inch of space out there. And also, you guys, they take a lot of pride in their ability to rebound the basketball, especially on the offensive end. Paul with the ball. Now guarded by Porzingis. Passes it to Paul. To the middle. And even three on three break. Here's Murray. Good. And the assist goes to Dante. Murray's got five. Uh, just a super unselfish guy. Doncic is all for getting his guys going. Enjoys setting the table. Paul passes to Howard. Ball against Doncic. Ball outside. Rocket six to the inside. Porzingis with the steal. Three on three. Back to Hardaway. But three. The Lakers with the rebound. And he's really trying to get them back into it, but the results just have not been there. Paul passes to Howard. And slammed in by Howard. Love the aggressive mind state. Howard showing how authoritative he is inside. Look here. Bradley's checked in for Brown. Cody Zeller comes in for Perzingis. Juan Hernan Gomez, he's checked in for Murray. And it's DeAnthony Melton in for Tim Hardaway Jr. And the Lakers also making a switch. Davis is checked in. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Mavericks. The pass to Melton. Back to Doncic. Throws it up high. And he pulls off the Houdini to take that catch and slam it through. Stupendous alley-oop. Doncic against Paul. LeBron a screen on Doncic. Paul against Doncic. Shot clock at six. Paul passes to James. Healed against Hernan Gomez. The shot will not fall. Davis with some nice D. Paul for three. Herman Gomez grabs the miss. And they had some boxed coverage that turned into no cover. Pass to Doncic. Zeller, a screen on Paul. Here's Doncic. A strong finish under heavy pressure all over. Doncic has got seven now in this quarter. They're scoring boatloads of buckets. It's raining buckets from inside. Doncic against Paul. 
Down low, Davis, and Davis throws it down. Oh, the movement off the ball is good. I mean, and the pass to hit him in stride is even better. Anjic passes to Melton. Doncic against Paul. Doncic kicks to Melton. Three-pointer. Rebounded by the Lakers. 22 is their biggest lead. Here is Paul. 12 points for him. Inside. No stopping him there. Jams it in as he's fouled. Chance now for a three-point play. It goes on Cody Zeller. That's just a perfect focus right there. I, mean, I like how Davis takes the hit and just keeps working to get to the buck. And the free throw stats for him. 9 of 12. Getting to the line on a regular basis. There's Melton. He's got five. Anjic with a screen on Beverly. Here's Melton. He can't get that one. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. Here's the screen. It's Davis on the wing. Kicks it to Beverly. Anjic with the steal. And here we go. The Mavericks in a fast break. He blocks it again. Uh, a defensive stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Greg protecting the rim. Love the hustle. Davis. And finished off by Davis. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. Uh, starting to take over here, building a big lead. And ultimately, it's a model. And Doncic, here we go, over Paul. No good off the back of the rim. It's been a struggle for him this quarter, but he's not losing confidence. I mean, he keeps firing. Give him credit for that. Davis with a screen on Doncic. Paul finds Davis, and it's Davis finishing it off. Talk about execution on the offensive end. They're leaving nothing on the table right now. Absolutely relentless. They're in the flow and riding that wave for as long as they can. To end the drought, and Davis sends it back. James a screen on Bradley, down low. LeBron, no luck. Dallas has gotten one of six three pointers to drop since coming out of the locker room at halftime. Eleven feet away, Melton, no good. I tell you what, the defense should send Christmas cards for that miss. Davis with a screen on Doncic. And it's Paul penetrating. It's rebounded by Dallas. Doncic has got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's Hernan Gomez. Offensive rebound. Back to Doncic. Pass to Bradley. There's another block. Making his presence felt on this end. He's holding down the fort. Anchoring the defense. Paul with the ball. And Zeller picks him up defensively. James dishes to heel. Now the Mavericks moving it up. Here's Melton. Plays it in off the breakaway. Melton's got seven. Way ahead of the field. He can do pretty much whatever he wants. Yeah, and defensively, you'd like to see a greater effort to change ends. And it's Paul penetrating, and it's good. Two points. That's the guy you want running the pick and roll. Paul's decision-making is great in those sets. Doncic looking it over. Over Paul. And Doncic gets it to go. Doncic has got nine points here in the second half. He's so aggressive at that end of the floor. That's a quality that all great scores have. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers. Riding high with a 23-point lead heading into the break. A look at the field goal percentage numbers tells the story of what tough defense they're playing today. We come back right after this. And let's go back to a terrific pass that we're calling tonight our State Farm assist of the game. And, you know, you can always count on him for at least a couple of these pretty assists over the course of a game. And this one, a thing of beauty. This is how you quarterback an offense. He sees and anticipates what the defense is doing. 
And we reach the fourth quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. Taking a look at Los Angeles. The two megastars are the big men, LeBron and Davis. Caldwell Pope out there with Josh Richardson. And it's healed in at the three spot. James, no good. Not his best game, but they're still getting it done collectively. Doncic, bounce pass. Pass to Persingas. Now Murray. Back to Persingas. It's stolen by Davis. From outside the arc, it's rebounded by Dallas. Doncic passes to Melton. Back to Doncic. It's stolen by Heel. Caldwell Pope with a wide open look. Good, and the assist goes to James. Three points. James has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. And so Doncic will bring it up for Dallas. Fourth quarter, still young, just over a minute play. And it's tonight. There's an intensity to Richardson's defense. Dallas ball. He puts full effort into it. He loves being that thorn in your side. Both teams deciding to change it up. So it's the Mavericks now. Here's Green. Rebounded by the Lakers. Davis has got rebound number 19 now. Incredible board work. Martin with it. Now Green defending. And it's Davis missing. Dallas shooting the ball poorly. Just 28%. Fires from deep. Again the miss by the Mavericks. For Los Angeles, they've gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. Here's Caldwell Pope. Hits the front of the rim and out. For Dallas, they've gone 0 of 3 to start the fourth quarter. The pass to Joe. There's the pick. Over to the wing. Christie against Batum. There's the drive. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Here's Davis. And he makes that one. Davis has got 44. It's just hard to believe that someone can perform at such a high level. They've got to thank him for this lead. Here's Christie. Misses the three. Uh, even for a player who's not a three-point specialist, I mean, that's a shot you've got to knock down. Dunn kicks to Davis. And they double up Davis. The feed to Martin. Ball's knocked loose. And Davis puts it in. Davis has got four this quarter. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Here's Persingas. And the dunk by Persingas. He's a really big man. Kristoff has insane handles for someone who is 7-3. Normally it's hard for players that tall to keep the ball on the bounce. Christie against Martin. Back to Dunn. Six to shoot. The dish to Davis. Batum trying to break loose. And he gets it back. That one good for two. Davis. Davis has got 48. And they're really in a good position here, thanks in part to the way he's been able to score the basketball. Here's Joe. Dunn covering. They get it again. Again with the block. And that's nine blocks. You know he's going to be coming hard for that tenth, too. Here's Christie. No luck. They battled on the glass but couldn't knock it down. Hey, it's time for him to start looking for other options. They can't let him keep shooting. His touch is gone. Dunn passes to Davis. And got it. Another basket. Oh, my goodness. 50 for the game. Yep, he is putting on a show. Here's Joe, done covering. Caleb Martin. The Mavericks making a change here. Rounds.
checked in. Now it's the lineup for your back. Moses Brand. Joe passes to Brown. Great D that time from Davis. Here's the Lakers with the ball. Stringing it together. They've got an 11-2 run going. To the paint. Yet another bucket. And he's up to 52 points. Yeah, making a GA look all too easy right now. And here is Green. Meyer, he's guarded by Caldwell Pope. To kick out to Brown, just five on the clock. Tries the spin move. Joe. And Davis sends it back. Shot clock violation. Lakers ball. Lakers have gone six of 11 since the start of the fourth quarter. Dunn passes to Davis, and it's Davis finishing it off. What unselfishness from the young guard, uh, Dunn. Uh, he's making more of an effort to, to distribute the ball. And Brown throws it down. Excellent assist there. Just led him to the perfect spot. Now, here's Dunn. Not a lot of room. Outside for Caldwell Pope. Davis setting the pick for Dunn. Trying to find Davis. He's got it now. Shoots over Brown. And it's blocked by Brown. And that'll be the Lakers as it goes out of bounds. Lakers retain possession. Juan Herman Gomez, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Tim Hardaway Jr. comes in for Green. Four on the shot clock. There's the screen. Tipped away. Dallas has gone 0-3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. Dallas moving it around. Outside, Brzingis. Pass to Joe. Done against Brown. Davis sets a screen. Caldwell Poe pass to Davis. Davis against Hernan Gomez. to Brown. And finished off by Brown. Great game for him. Double-double now. 10 points and 11 rebounds. And he just punishes the D for falling asleep at the wheel. Yeah, a little disorganized that time. And the result, two points in the loudest way possible. Oh, well, well, listen, guys. That was great work. Making them pay for the laps on defense. Passes it to Caldwell Pope. Batum a screen on Hernan Gomez. Outside for Martin. And again, the Lakers no good. Guys, we've seen a lot of turnovers in this one. Yeah, focus, focus, Lakers focus. Back. Just make it. It's simple. That's his first personal foul. Second team foul. Substitution for your Mavericks. Tony Bradley. DeAnthony! Now here is Hardaway. Six on the shot clock. From deep three-point range, Melton no good. Man, he missed that one, but I've seen him drill shots from that distance in warm-ups. Yeah, and I have too, which is why they're okay with it. I'm sure if he gets that kind of look again, he's going to let it fly. Again. Davis. And Davis puts Davis. it in. Chris Moving this aspect of his game. When Dunn looks to involve his teammates in the screen and rolls, it's great. There's the pass to Melton. Hardaway against Smart from short range. And Davis pulls it down. Credit to D for not giving up on that play. He's a tough cover down low. He dishes it to Caldwell Pope. Shot. 
Davis with a screen on Hernan Gomez. And Davis can't get it to go. And here's Melton. He'll bring it up for the Mavericks. Hardaway passes to Melton. And it's blocked. Davis surveying the floor. Out of bounds. Dallas, Dallas takes Bennett. possession. Dallas! Zinkis is checked in for Brown. Dallas for the lineup for your battle. Kristoff for Zinkis. Dallas has gone ice cold from three-point land 0-4 since the start of the final quarter. Melton finds Bradley. Poked away. Martin with it. Pass to Davis. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Davis has got 58. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. To the inside. Now Caldwell Pope. Always going up for the alley-oop here. To the middle. Here's Bradley. And he dunks it down. Well, if you don't take care of the ball, fellas, that's what can happen. Absolutely, Greg. That makes the turnover even more painful. Yeah, going defense to offense in an instant. Every team now calibrated to do that. Coldwell Pope with it. Now guarded by Brad. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Yeah, easy call. First team foul. At the line for the Lakers. Anthony Davis. That one is off. He hits the second from the line. And for the Mavericks, they're shooting 28%. A rocky, rocky performance for them offensively. Outside Hardaway. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Inside. Here's Bradley. And a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. And he's now got the double-double. Ten points and ten rebounds. Dunn dishes to Davis. Bradley against Dunn. Caldwell Poe passes to Batum. Six to shoot. Los Angeles needs and good. He hits it again. He has taken over this game. And now GA tied for the second most points in a playoff game all time. He's equaled the great Elgin Baylor, 61 points, an extraordinary game. And just not much more you can say, guys. It's the end of the line for one team and a hard-fought, well-deserved trip to the NBA Finals for the Lakers. In the end, they had a better shooting percentage, and that's what made the difference. Sometimes, you know, things go your way. The other team wasn't catching many lucky breaks themselves. Yeah, and, and, and good! And there's the another! And guys, he's now tied the all-time mark for points in a playoff game. Wow, he has been cooking since the opening tip, and they've been powerless to slow him down. His airness with a little company on his lofty perch. Just remarkable. Here's Persingas. Again, the Mavericks score. Offensively, there's few things on the court Porzingis can't do. He can use his length, strength, or both. Here's Dunn. Davis sets a screen. Dunn passes to... And again! And he set a new all-time record for single-game scoring in the playoffs. I mean, what a night to remember. And for those of us who are lucky enough to witness it, I'm sure we will never forget this. And it was way back in 1986 that Michael Jordan set the record of 63 points. And when you surpass the greatest of all time, you've done something special.
Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. And now, we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Anthony Davis. And his performance has been a jaw dropper. He must have been feeling great coming into the building tonight. Because once he hit the court, it was all working for him. He was in a zone. The Western Conference crowd is going to be theirs. And he's the number one reason why. As clutch a performance you could ask for in a game with everything on the line. Thirty-two seconds left to play here in the fourth. Pass to Hernan Gomez. Porzingis with a screen on Batum. Hernan Gomez passes to Doncic. Here's Bradley. There's another block. He's now tied for second most blocks ever recorded in the playoff. Greg, you've seen a lot. I have too. But I can honestly say it's one of the greatest defensive performances I have ever witnessed. Aldwell Pope wishes today and finished off by Davis. Assisted. Saw the opportunity to put this away and did not turn it down. That's the that. You can tell they wanted that one. I know that's it. And the Los Angeles Thank Lakers will move on. Get out the game. We, we know they had to time. battle through right very tough Western, Western Conference. But they were able to survive the test and earn a trip to the NBA Finals. From day one, this was their goal. Make it to the Finals. But really, this is just the beginning for them. Mm -hmm. and, exactly. And, you know, they'll take a moment to kind of bask in victory here. But, but it won't be a long one. They know they've got a very tough opponent coming for them out of the East. And, and they're going to get straight to business in terms of prep for the Finals. Still, they get to celebrate tonight. And they've earned it as champions of the West. That concludes this broadcast of the Western Conference Finals. For Chris Weber, Craig Anthony, and David Olden, this is Kevin Harlan. Thank you for being with us. See you later.